Tēnā roa te tātou, ko Karangawai e Māsh tōku ingoa, kai te Māngirea Centre tātou, ngā tohu o Uenuku. E roti e te whare nei, te tai whakātura ngā toi, o te pūtahi a toi, tēnā hoa ki tātou ki roto. I was one of those kids that doodled a lot in my books. I probably had more pictures in my books than I did answers to any questions. And then I decided I wanted to pursue um, the bachelor degree in Māori Visual Arts. Most of my art that I've created recently um, is around te reo Māori and how Māori, we, as Māori, we've responded to the issue of losing our reo. The Pope or were inspired by one of my marae, Te Tōkanga Nui Anoho and Te Kuiti, and a lot of the carvings they have um, text. This particular installation is in reference to Te Reo o Te Pai, Te Reo Nga Kui o Nga Karaua Nga Rātou Te Kaupapui Whakatū. Te Atārangi was an initiative to bring the Reo into the community, as opposed to it being site-specific, which it was for quite a while. You know, you don't hear the Reo in the marae or in the whare karakia. And every rako, especially when we're teaching the Reo, has its, um, has its own mana. So yeah, I wanted to give each one its own little standing place in the pipeline. There are more and more Māori language speakers coming through, through the arts, um, which is awesome. And um, kind of changes, I suppose, the hohonetanga of the mahi. But I don't know if it's so much what the reo has done for the art community, but more so what the art community can do for the reo. Umere te reo.